one of my fears have finally come to pass. Uh, Adobe has officially acquired Algorithmic, and this simply means that every single thing that you've been making use of from both Substance Designer to Substance Painter to even Substance Material is now automatically an Adobe product. This is one of those things that when it happens, it hits you with mixed reaction, knowing fully well what has happened with previous apps that have been purchased by Adobe and how far they've gone into pushing them into being apps that are industry standard or apps that just ended up and, fade, and faded away. For me, I think I am also struck with the same mixed reaction, which I think a lot of us would also be struck with. And today has been said that it is a milestone for these two companies to come together. And if you have been working with anything that has to do with 3D and you're into texturing, by now you should know that when it comes to game asset texturing, that Substance has always taken the lead when it comes to material design. Substance also takes a lead when it comes to that. We also know that there are other competitions like Mari and all that. But when it comes to game assets, uh, texturing and uh, asset creations for uh, materials and all that substance the guys from allogometric they have done a very good job from the ground up and then imagine with adobe is a good thing from a point and from another point i i am actually skeptical about it what i'm going to say is for us to get them working together would be a nice stuff because they would have a lot more resource to work with and I also think they might become very good partners. And if you look at what was said earlier, when you look at the statement from the guys at Allegorithmic, they are saying that for now, nothing would change when it comes to licensing and every single thing that you've been working with would uh, still remain the same. They say when it comes to licensing, nothing changes for now. I'm just scared because the word for now is simply saying that within this period they're imagine for now there might not be anything but maybe later on it might become some sort of monthly subscription stuff and that scares me a lot and it says your current licenses will continue running and getting updates okay as we join the adobe family we will also unveil new and more flexible subscription and this is what scares me a lot the new and flexible subscription plan is what scares me a lot because now instead of just owning this stuff the way we were doing it and enjoying ourselves before maybe now they might come up and say you have to pay an extra fee so that you can own it for a month you have to pay an extra fee so that you can own it for just two months or maybe some few weeks and so on and so forth and these multinational companies they keep doing things i mean these uh, multi-billion companies they keep doing stuff like this and that is one of the fears I have when it comes to them merging together. The subscription part scares me a lot. The next fear which I have is I don't know if I'm the only one that is having this kind of fear, but we all knew when Fuse was bought by Adobe, the Fuse that was integrated with Mixamo, and we saw what happened within the line of all of a sudden we thought there was going to be a lot of development but after a couple of months it looks like one of those other apps that was just existing there are things that i felt would have come to fuse that maybe by now you should be able to like change make your own characters online but automatically i think they killed the fuse project because now except you go and download the old version of the fuse you cannot even make use of fuse itself so these are things that i've caught up with mixed reaction and I would like to know what you think about this merger in the comment section below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to subscribe, you can hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on notification. And until I see you guys next time with more updates, peace.